friends, and welcome to Symphony Storytime, where we share two of our favorite things, books and music. My name is Amy, and I'll be your reader today, and I want you to say hi to my friend from the Oregon Symphony, who will be providing the music that goes along with our story. Hi, Amy, and hi, everyone. My name is Kenji, and I play the viola. And my viola's name is Mortimer. And I like the viola because I feel like it's the same range as my voice, and I can talk through it, and sometimes I talk to it, and we have conversations. How are you doing, Mortimer? Want to say hi to everybody out there? <laughs> Thanks, Mortimer and Kenji. Our book today is Because, the story of a little girl and how she discovers her love of music. Let's get started. Because, score by Mo Willems, performance by Amber Wren, published by Hyperion Books for Children, New York. This is how it happened. Because a man named Ludwig wrote beautiful music, a man named Franz was inspired to create his own. Because many years later, people wanted to hear Franz's beautiful music, they formed an orchestra. Because a man had practiced since he was a kid, he was asked to join. Because a woman studied night and day, she too was asked to play. Because many others loved and practiced their instruments, there were enough musicians. Because someone created a poster about Franz's music, tickets were sold. Because the train conductor stopped the train at the grand concert hall, the orchestra conductor arrived. Because the orchestra librarian had copies of the score, the orchestra rehearsed. Because workers checked the lights and the seats and swept the floors, the grand hall was ready. Because the time had come, the ushers opened the doors. Because someone's uncle caught a cold, someone's aunt had an extra ticket for someone special. Because the usher helped the aunt and her special guest, they found their seats. Because everyone was there to hear beautiful music, it was quiet. Row C, seat 14, 
sat the girl with the uncle's ticket. She heard the beautiful music written by the man named Franz, and it changed her. The girl was changed. From that moment on, the girl learned everything she could about music because it fed her. Soon she started to write music too, because like Franz, the young woman had something to share. Over time, the woman became very good because she worked very hard. One night, her music was discovered because she was also very lucky. Then she was invited to perform her music at the Grand Concert Hall because so many people wanted to hear it. Her composition was dedicated to the uncle in row C, seat 14, because it was his ticket that brought her here. And that night, someone else was changed. That is how it happens. We love this story about this little girl and how she comes to find the thing that she loves most in the world. It's time for me to leave you now. But you keep watching because Kenji has some special music for you. I'll see you again soon. Bye-bye. And I just wanted to share with you something that I love to play on the viola. This is from the composer Johannes Brahms. It's his uh, two songs for viola, voice, and piano. And as I mentioned, the viola is the same range as the human voice, and I feel like I can talk through it, or I can also sing. And this really sings and shows off what I love about the viola. Hi everybody, good to see you again. I'm Kenji Bunch. And uh, do you remember what I play for the Oregon Symphony? That's right, I play the ukulele. Uh, wait a sec. No, I, guess, I guess I don't play this. Uh, oh, yeah, of course I play the kazoo. Oh, um, no, I don't play the kazoo in the symphony. Oh yeah, this thing. Ooh. No, I don't use that thing. I, oh yeah, this thing. Uh, maybe I don't do that. I know. It's this. Uh, okay. Uh, yes, now I know what I do. I play the viola, right? You remember Mortimer the viola? He says, hi, everybody. Mortimer, um, what do you want to tell the, everybody out here about um, our little room here? This is our music room. Yeah, this is where I write music and I practice and I mess around with other fun instruments just because music should be fun. And it helps me to get my work done when I feel like I'm playing. So whatever you do with music, make sure you have fun and make sure even if you're working hard at something, you're still playing. Okay? Uh, you remember the viola? It's a string instrument with four strings. It, you've got the violins, 
that are kind of smaller, the cellos that are bigger, the basses that are really big, and the viola is like right in the middle there. It's like the peanut butter in the sandwich. Really good to see all of you and hope to catch you another time. Take care.